dismantling a bus. I mean, we're making it a little less school bus today. the uh, air and wires to operate this are on that side. So I'm going to take this side off first so that once I take these screws out the rest of the way, she wants to swing down. Just let it hang on that. There's enough slack behind here to let it hang easily and gracefully and not. see if you're doing this yourself get an idea what's behind here again this is a bluebird all american but we've got basically get this out of the way air and power and um we've already identified inside where it's all running out through here, so we don't plan on reusing it for anything in the bus, so I'm just going to go ahead and snip, snip, and uh, get this out of our way. It's kind of cool to see visible steps, but the reality is we need to keep moving and get some stuff done today before it gets too hot, it's probably noonish. So crank up the music and kick it into hyperspeed. the AC off the roof and we've already exposed it um, 
you can see that panel down there was covering it. So that was the cover. I lowered that down with some ropes. Now we gotta get this off. So part of this video is really just documenting and how it's hooked up. So this line crosses to this side. This line comes out and crosses to that side. Um, this should be fun. Whatever. Just taking it off. I highly doubt we're going to reuse this. Um, it was functioning, so we could sell it or donate it. Uh, but a good possibility is that no one will want it. So, whatever. Um, just keep moving forward. Okay, so what I'm going to do while you're up here, I'm going to turn this end towards this side, right? And then, um, that's going to allow me to have, when I push it off the edge, you're going to be holding pressure on that rope on those bungees yeah. or tie downs and that way it can't slide only when you give it a slap yeah. and then this is going to be my lifeline to be able to keep it away from the bus if it goes to fall and I just need to hang. Wrap it around your hand. There you go. Okay. Give it a little slap, a foot or so. Huh? That was probably stupid to put it on something riveted, but whatever. It's down safely. Well, we don't know what happened to the bus. I didn't hear any glass shatter. I could hear metal scratching from a yeah. bolt that got underneath. Nah, I mean, there's a scratch, but it's not it's anything big deal at all. <laughs> Told you to come down with that angle. I'm glad no one was standing there, damn. Well, and it did, like, it scraped on the window thing, and then it misses the window, like, right there. Like, if it would have stopped and, like, been resting on the window. Right so, I hook to that. So I needed to hook to something with a better connection, so yeah, it's like completely my bad. Yeah. There's a rusted on the thing that coming off. Yeah, it was my stupidity, man. If I'd have been on this side, that could have been ugly. Of course, I'd like to think I'd have been smart enough not to be standing up. Yeah. Okay, grab that side if you can. Might be able to grab underneath.
it's probably pretty windy. I don't know what it sounds like on the mic, but what I'm doing is removing this back window. Right? And so, right in here, I don't know if you can see with the glare, but this little tubing is split. And so what I'm doing is remove it, right? And so I'll save this because we're going to need that to put it back in. We do plan on reusing these windows. So what I'm going to do is just see if I can now pry this up because it left this gap. That should soften this up enough. Yep. All right. So I'm going to set you back here. And we're going to see how this process goes. Okay, so I definitely got this loosened up uh, without much of a problem. I can feel the window wanting to move. I think it's going to go in. So I'd actually like a second set of hands because I haven't done this before. And we do want to reuse these windows. And if I got to take it off from the inside, I also got to push from the outside. So that means I'm reaching around here all awkward. And um, I'm getting old. I don't feel like being twisted like a pretzel so whatever I'll just have Carla come down she's pretty good at helping with stuff like this and we'll have a blast together you'll see us because I just go around and loosen up I can actually see it going inside the window and just gently you know, just putting a little force on it just to break uh, this is bus is about 15 years old, so 15 years of heat and stuff has the rubber stuck in places. This is a Florida bus. So I can see it's already pretty loose. Window out.
you know, we could slide the glass out, but I'm not going to bother with that. When we cut the roof on, we're going to try and cut below this and salvage this so I don't have to reframe it, but we'll see what happens. But let's window out.